Hey guys, so today I do have an iPhone 5 uh, with the jailbreak here, jailbroken iOS 7.1.1 uh, with this new Pango jailbreak and I'm doing a video about it actually. Uh, and then we do have iOS 8 here on the white iPhone. Uh, so uh, let's just do a quick little video here, checking it out uh, in terms of uh, speed and all those good things. So I'm just gonna start off here by closing down everything. Kabam, kabam, kabam. Okay, sweet. So, uh, let's uh, check this out here, shall we? Uh, let's just go, first of all, you can see Cydia here. And you can see that this one is running iOS 8 beta 2, actually. And this one is all oh, jawbroken. <laughs> nice, nice, yeah. Okay, so um, now let's have some fun here. Let's start off here with the Geekbunch app. See if there's any big difference. Do, do, do. So this is probably not going to take that long time, but it's a fun little test to do. It's a fun little test. Okay, sweet, so yeah, very, very identical here in terms of this little score. Uh, the non jailbroken iPhone uh, with iOS 8 actually gets a little bit higher there. Uh, but overall, we shouldn't really see a big difference there. Okay, so we also have, of course, we can do some speed testing here. And uh, just make sure here we're running on the same. Let's get 465G, but both. No, okay, that's horrible. You shouldn't run them at the same time. Uh, next time, I'm not gonna do it. But which one is dominating the network here? Wow, very, very identical. Doesn't seem, um, yeah, overall it doesn't seem like you have any slowdown here on the network. Seems to be very, very identical. As it should be, as it should be. So I don't think we have to redo this because, okay, let's redo it. Let's start off here with the jailbroken iPhone with 7.1.1. Oh, that's nice. Very, very nice speed here. <laughs> 80. Also upload seems to also be pretty nice. This is also check it out here. And I was 8 beta 2. Yeah, big difference here. I also put one but one seems to be a little bit more stable also in terms of Wi-Fi. Upload though seems to be still be being as strong as before. Nice there to know. Uh, let's just uh, check out also some opening of some apps. Right now we have two apps, or actually three apps on both. Actually, we have Cydia here as well, so let's just close that. Uh, but let's just uh, open up some things here, like the phone app. You can see faster than I was eight. Let's see here if we can 
load up Apple's website simultaneously. Sweet. So overall, it doesn't seem to be any major slowdowns. Hmm. Let's just see here if we can open up. Just because it's in a beta, we probably have a lot of random things in terms of it. A lot of like perhaps like glitches that could come up. Whoa. Let's also turn them off and turn them on here, same time. I just want to make sure, yeah, I was 8 here, it's definitely a little bit slower booting down. But uh, now, let's uh, do this. I think iOS 8 beta was pretty slow if I can recall. Yeah, you can see 7.1.1 here very very fast. Or faster. <laughs> of course you don't get a lot of cool features inside of the inside of the iOS 8 at the moment, but iOS 8 is going to come. It's going to come this fall, and that's definitely going to be very, very nice. There we have iOS 8 up and running. So just quickly look at that. Uh, hopefully you did enjoy. If you did, please leave a like. And hopefully I'll see you all in the next video. So yeah, peace out.